Don't give up on us, baby. Don't make the moon seem right. Can't we stay the way we are? It's written in the moonlight and painted on the stars. We can change ours just for the rainy evenings. And baby stars are few. Don't give up on a sign now. We can still come true. I really lost my head last night. You got a right to start believing. There's still a little love left, even so. Today, uh, dated. December 7, Wednesday. This is a history of my life. At the point of age of my life where I would say I thank God for the good times and the bad times of my life. And with all my heart and soul that I'm still living on this earth. God has a purpose for my life. You know, sometimes I... I ask God for many reasons why in many cross of paths I walk with my life. There are many hardships and struggles. I mean, I cannot complain because God had blessed me with a peaceful life. Though, sometimes my heart and soul may be tested by how much pain I can go on with my life. Like, it made me cry, but I know that. God is God, a God of merciful. Many people that I've trust with, I've helped. I'm a very kind person. I, I, I help a lot with helping hands in many works, monies. I'm generous. But you know, sometimes people can turn you apart, you know. Sometimes people betray you tell lies to you, the intentions were not good, some can even mock and persecute you and do but I realize in my life that the people I trust with, whether it's a friend or whoever those times when I trusted so much, I tell my secrets I give my all of what I have as a person money, helping them in their problems everything that I can give whether it's by money or in any financial or in i mean in many aspects to help others but sometimes god will put you to test that people will betray you will will say bad things to you and you know many of a bad intentions but god is god so i'm still gonna leave my life to the police until my last bit before god took away my life and I want to say this that God is such a wonderful God. It's hard to have many faith if you know whether it's what religion we have as a Christian. Whatever is your religion, God is still God. Sometimes it's hard to believe living in this life because every day we live in a rush time of the life. Uh, we're busy now there are many desires we make a living human ways every day that we're living but you know time as it is we should remember god we don't see him it's hard to feel him it's hard to listen to him it's hard to say that in this crazy world in this crazy life while i'm still alive before my life and as it is that it's hard for me to answer every details, every single details of life. And when my mom got sick, you know, that was so difficult, you know, all the time. I I better disagree that life was not easy. I hardly, like, you know, I sacrificed everything. I took the chance that all the time I should be there for her and feeding her and everything. And every single detail of her, I gave my all. Uh, I'm not married, I'm single, but all my life I sacrificed, I devoted my life to my mom, to my family. It's not just whether it's my work or if I end up giving up my work or, you know, uh, I, I realize that it's very important to have God in your life whether you are jobless, 
you have nothing or you're broke you don't have money or wealth or anything for me i'm a confident being nothing because god is god he makes me complete with her I don't have anything in life. I'm confident that God has blessed me and will give me the right thing and the right path in my life. Say Amen to Jesus.